Exodiac 85 X presents T Hello, YouTube, and welcome to another exciting episode. But this time, it's going to be much, much different. Now, I just want to share something. I received a message on my phone. Let me just find this text. I'd like to share it with all of you. It says, okay. It says, I received this message this evening, but did not send because I wanted to check Snoops first. Snoops had no info regarding this, therefore it may be authentic. Tonight at 12.30 a.m., to 3.30 a.m. Make sure to turn off the phone, cellular devices, including tablets, etc., and put them away from your body. Singapore Television announced the news today. Please tell your family and friends that tonight at 12.30 to 3.30 our planet will be exposed to very high radiation from cosmic rays passing close to Earth. Therefore, you must turn off your cell phones and other devices. Do not leave them close to your body. It can cause you terrible damage. Check Google and NASA BBC News. Please send this message to everyone that you love or care about. Call them and make sure they get the message. Now, this is what I have to say to that. It is time to debunk that text. Apparently, hold on, I got my drink. I have to take a drink to celebrate, guys. Ooh, ooh, ooh. It is time. It is time to debunk this. Now, first, let's get the facts straight. All right. In order to cosmic rays, which produce high amounts of radiation, to do bodily harm to humans, a, super, a supernova would have to be within 50 light years to the Earth during the explosion. Now, the majority is produced through supernovas and a small percentage of that is produced from our sun, but you know what happens? Our atmosphere around the Earth, that magnetic field absorbs all that harmful radiation by the time it hits and deflects. So by the time it even comes down, it basically tiny tiny particles which literally become harmless um, the biggest thing you have to worry about is ultraviolet rays but even then you know most people wearing sunscreen and only being out in the sun for so long yeah you'll be fine um, but yeah I just wanted to fix that up it is complete hoax if you do receive it on your cell phone do not listen to it. It's been going around and circulating since 2008. And basically, it's fake. I know my science. I definitely know my science. Especially if it involves space. Now, I love sci-fi movies, especially ones that involve space. I'm a huge fan. I'm even more of a fan of space. So, let me read something real quick. Okay. The most recent supernova visible to the eye was Supernova 1987A in the year 1987. It was approximately 168,000 light years away. 
Before that, the last supernova visible to the eye was documented by Johannes Kepler in 1604. At about 20,000 light years, it shone more brightly than any star in the sky. It was even visible in daylight, but it didn't cause earthly effects, as far as we know. Even if Betelgeuse just exploded into a supernova, it wouldn't hurt us. We're talking 430 light years away. And by the time it got here, we'd be all fine. It would have to be within 50 light years to do any damage. And we know Betelgeuse is a super giant star. But the facts is, it's facts. And, uh, you know, we'd be alright. Because it's just too far of a distance. Even if you're a super giant star, that kind of distance, nope, wouldn't hurt us at all. So I'm going to leave some links down in the description for you guys to look at for some sources. You guys take a look at it for yourself. And also, remember to like, comment, and subscribe. Remember, stay up with my videos. I will be releasing videos as often as I can. And um, right now I've been having a bit of drink. <sighs> and it's starting to hit me. So, I'm going to do some gaming, and I'll probably do some streaming after this, but um, you guys make sure to uh, look at the uh, description and take a look at those links, and so you guys can know for yourself. Anyways, I'll see you guys next time. Remember to like, comment, and subscribe. Stay tuned to my channel, guys. I'll see you guys next time. You guys have a nice night. Remember to like, comment, and subscribe.